That didn't work. That didn't work either. What? What do I do then? Did he write something down? No. What the fuck? Am I like missing something here? Okay, I threw the corrode on the wall thing. And now it should break open, but it's it's not opening. How come I can move these? Uh, I can't. Okay, maybe if I just... Oh wait, the lights. The light. The light! Okay, I guess my light wasn't good enough. me things schizophrenic illusions I know you're dead you have to be dead there's no way you're alive there's no way you could be living because if you are alive we would not be in this situation and there wouldn't be man bear pigs chasing me This leaking world and the renderers seem to be taking over the garden by the wall. I could dig them for you. No, no, get out. Get out of this house. You leave them be. sewers? Did he write? No. Oh! Ah! Well that's lovely. That's probably the first time I've seen them make a skeleton in this game. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scaled, de-aired, and scraped ready for gambroiling and evisceration. For this, we pass them through the steam reservoir, which is kept at the constant temperature by passing excessive high pressure venting from the engines via the boiler and a series of large copper pipes into stone chambers just below the workhouse. At the center of the machine, there is a component that must be kept at a consistently low temperature which controls operations of the processing of product through the system. Alongside this, refrigeration is the most utmost important in retaining product quality. And this also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution. The removal of heat in some areas and the requirements for increased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principle of convection regulated by the boiler and sending freezing air along, along one set of pipes in one direction, a superheated evaporous in another. Man, it's hard to read. Isn't it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? We can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excreta flooding through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. Thank God, the stench! 
This fecal matter is the true product of the age. So this is all shit. My mystery, mysterious friend is correct. The sewers are indeed flooded. To descend further, I will have to find the local sluence pumps to drop the water levels. The smell is almost unbearable. It makes me gag. Why should the saboteur have flooded the tunnels, though? What did he hope to achieve? I don't know. Ask your uncle. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Are you fucking serious? For fuck's sake. I hate that fucking thing. So I am going to murder... ...so many children. I hear you, but I don't see you. I hear you, but I don't see you. You better not be fucking behind me. I hear it. There's no way it's gone. I'm finding the ambient sound a lot more annoying than, like, scary. Alright, I know the instant I turn one of these corners, he's gonna, like, come out. So what I'm going to do is walk this way. <sighs> okay, fuck! Fuck you. Just fuck you. Fuck you. Shut up. Several of the older forms have breached their containment area and escaped into the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no Kelman. I am no Eliaf who. What? At least not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway open that is to blame. We cannot simply pack them about with coolant as we do at the center where the doorway is. 
The later versions are kept safe by freezing temperatures of those towers. Up here, where the air is hot and feeded, they become overheated and their duality tears them. Oh, their duality tears them asunder, as the other place flies from their cells and their vitae splinters. They live sporadically, torn from one world to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds, they are creatures of this world. Then they are torn away and cease to have physical form. This vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected areas sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. These are damned places now. The abode have failed experiments. Ghosts of fear and spite. So that explains the water monster. Oh, a little update of where we're at. We were there. And now we're there. Made progress. If I do so say myself. Okay, so that's one open. Cool, I guess. Oh. I feel like the light is just flickering, just a flicker. Oh. Hello. What's up? Just playing Sam and Are you streaming that right now? Yeah. I'm in the sewers and they brought back the water monster because they're a bunch of dicks. Huh. Is it scary? I've had a few scares. They took out a few things, though. Yeah, like, it doesn't seem like it's that scary. Like, they took out, like, it seems like they took out the whole idea that you had to hide. Now really? you just Now you just kind of sneak by things. Or run from them. What's this? Well, running is, you know, understandable, but, like, huh. The hiding aspect was, like, really popular among amnesia, ga amnesia games. And then they took out the inventory system. What? The fuck? <laughs> and then. Are you? Is your stream on a delay? No. Well, so it's a. I could. It's a slight delay, but it's not but like it's, it's not internet. Huge. It's like internet-wise, like. So if I was to watch it. You'd be pretty caught up, like. Okay. I just oh, don't want to get okay. on the stream and then like have it. Have it just be like. <laughs> <laughs> Nope, you're behind. Sorry. It'll you'll be like a f a few seconds behind. That's about it. Okay, I found where I'm going. Oh yeah, it's not that bad. Yeah. And I said, "Look, my darlings, can you see it?" And they said, "Yes, daddy. Yes, we see it. A tall, weathered cap of steed-sided pyramid, so like those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit." Vines crawling about intertwining the suk su the what? <laughs> How do you even say that? <laughs> the stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this here, this is where the king sat. And this is where the priest lived. This house, this is the house of the dead. And here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings. They most certainly were not savages, you see. They believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed 
that offering blood